This dispute between Sandeep Maheswari and Dr. Vivek Bindra started on 11th December when Sandeep Maheswari uploaded a video on his YouTube channel with the title Big Scam Exposed. Yeah, I watched uh, Mm. And uh, uh, in that video, actually, some of young people talked about they were a scam. Blind follower may be related with Sandeep Maheswari. Blind followers are uh, uh, may be related with Dr. Vivek Bindra. Sandeep Maheswari is Ram and Dr. Vivek Bindra is Ramad. Hello, ma'am. Uh, Deepak, how are you doing? I am pretty good since morning and... Uh, it's going on very fine, excellent, magnificent, amazing. <laughs> your day seems to be really amazing. I can sense that <laughs> your, you know, voice. <laughs> okay. So, uh, okay. So, Deepak, I want you to introduce yourself to the audience. Okay, ma'am. So, uh, as you know, uh, my name is uh, Deepak Maurya. I belong to district Jaunpur, Uttar Pradesh. Uh, UP and uh, currently I'm living in Prayagraj city, Allahabad mm. and uh, I have completed my post graduation in political science from uh, University of Allahabad with the subject political science is with a special reference to international politics. Mm -hmm. and, uh, currently I am a freelancer, YouTuber, an English learner, and <laughs> recently I, I have started a new YouTube channel, and my YouTube channel name is English Phobia, and uh, this channel is dedicated to especially UP and Bihar, so that's all about me. Thank you very much. Okay, why is it especially dedicated to uh, UP and Bihar state people? Why not everyone? Yeah, it is for everyone, but uh, uh, actually, uh, uh, I will tell you the logic and reason behind this, uh, why I said uh, that it is especially for UP and Bihar. Actually, maximum 90% of students uh, mm -hmm. are from Hindi medium student. Mm -hmm. So, 90% uh, you can say 90, 92% people. Uh, so, uh, they are facing this problem of English speaking and uh, English fluency and they have been learning this language for a long time. Uh, you can say uh, five years, six years, seven years, eight years. The tragedy is that they are unable to speak this language. Hmm. Okay. They are, yeah, it, it has become a matter of status. But people want to learn this language, but they don't have any environment of English speaking. They don't have any uh, environment of uh, English language. So, so I think uh, uh, people are suffering for a long time. Uh, so that is the reason why I said uh, this uh, channel, English Phobia, is dedicated to especially UP and Bihar. And I am just not talking about uh, uh, Hindi medium student, mm. but even in UP and Bihar, if you analyze, mm. uh, you will get to know that English medium students who are from CBSC board, mm. ISC board, mm. from English uh, board, they are also unable to speak English. This is the tragedy of education. I, I must say, even, even, English teachers are unable to speak English very fluently. Yes, they can speak, uh, they can teach English. Uh, there is no doubt about in this matter. But when it comes to speak English very fluently, then English teachers and English board students are also unable to speak English very fluently. Hmm. So uh, this is the reason and logic uh, behind the name. Uh, what do you think about this? Uh, whatever I have uh, told you. People, after listening to you, I want to tell you that there is no, you told me that, ma'am, there is no such environment in the schools, and you mentioned the states too. 
let me tell you among those states come punjab also and there are many yeah. states, i can say in, in whole india there is no english speaking environment at all now i can feel that parents are becoming really aware they try to create they try to speak in english with their children so that they can grasp all the words and sentences and they can also start speaking people there was you know if i talk about my background there was never any such kind of environment in my family too and yeah. the second point you you said that students are suffering students have this phobia they have this fear why do they have this fear in the first place why is it a matter of fear see you just have to change your thought process and half the battle is solved so what i feel that nowadays okay learning okay. this language is way much more easier than the time when there was no internet okay yeah. and even if we have internet there were not many resources so what i feel if children if other youngsters they are trying to speak in english for a long period of time and yet they are not able to see that means they are lagging somewhere okay and please it is not any disease that they are suffering from it is just a language they just have to understand it it's a language to communicate and it if uh, you know nowadays i see many institutes who offer other languages like french spanish and they say in one month in three months you can learn and i have seen people speaking in other foreign languages in two three months people can learn other foreign languages in two or three months how come they are not able to understand this language okay and the main reason i find is that they really don't speak people are consuming so much english related content there are many students who i okay they are consuming so much content but the problem is that they do not speak that is the main problem the first problem is if they start speaking they can overcome this problem and they can actually become fluent with time see fluency takes time okay so they have to give some time and they just have to practice speaking every day then that uh, if you can invest in yourself if you uh, think you can afford some money please uh, you can go for english classes too that's the easy way and then they can easily speak why not so i tell about my mother my mother has studied in a hindi medium school okay yet she can speak in english a little bit a little bit she can because she tries to speak even in hindi medium school there is a subject english yeah of course don't use i think in class 5 or 6 now i don't know but in my mother's time she told me it was introduced in class 5 or 6 right but she still speaks she is able to because she is fond of this language she is fond of speaking so she tries to speak with me or her grandchildren if such people such age people can talk why can't these youngsters or children so please i i really don't want to uh, you know i don't want you to tell this to any of your student or to anyone that you know ma'am they don't have that kind of environment this is just an excuse i'm sorry to say i may sound brutally honest here but that's their excuse yeah if you want to learn this language then first of all you no, do not read to uh, grammars or english newspapers just try to open your mouth and try to speak it doesn't matter at all whether it is wrong or easy just try to speak whatever you have information and uh, knowledge in your mind just try to speak and uh, of course uh, practice makes a man perfect mm -hmm. but uh, i don't believe in this statement actually i will tell you okay uh, uh, i believe that right practice with right process will make you perfect yeah absolutely so uh, are you getting my point yes yes i am so uh, i think process is necessary and uh, of course uh, uh, if you want to learn this language uh, you must have patience and uh, english uh, such a language it takes time it is uh, it takes a long time if you want to uh, be fluent in english so deep up in our previous conversation that we could not complete so you told me that you worked for vivek bindra's company also yeah tell me 
Yeah, actually, uh, this dispute between Sandeep Maheswari and Dr. Vivek Bindra started on 11th December when Sandeep Maheswari uh, uploaded a video uh, on his YouTube channel with the title Big Scam Exposed. Yeah, I watched uh, mm. And uh, uh, in that video, actually, some of young people talked about they were scammed in this company and uh, they have bought uh, they have bought online course for 50000 and which was not remarkable as company marketed it so mm -hmm. but in that video no uh, no students uh, taken the name of any scammer but mm -hmm. uh, after some time uh, uh, on social media, uh, there was a message was being spreaded on social media that uh, it is pointed to Dr. Vivek Bindra. And, yeah, but I, uh, wait, uh, I'm sorry, but you didn't answer to my question that you were working for his company, right, Vivek Bindra? Yes, I am working as a freelancer uh, in Bada Business. Yeah. Okay. So what is your work there? What is your profile like? Yeah, actually related with some business consulting. Actually, the Bada Business provides business education and mm -hmm. online business training programs mm -hmm. and uh, uh, business training and courses. So this is a ad tech company. And okay. uh, that is education uh, through technology, through technology. So, so uh, this is... Things are actually real, true? Yeah. Could you repeat it again, ma'am? Sorry. Can say that allegations of Vivek Bindra are these actually true or it is really not uh, the fact? What do you think? Actually, uh, uh, Sandeep Maheswari, you know, uh, he is also a motivational speaker and is an Indian entrepreneur, and uh, he is widely known for his uh, motivational talks and yeah. uh, personality development, and mm. he is also known for uh, YouTube. So. Uh, Sandeep Maheswari in his video uh, uploaded on uh, uh, 20th December. So he made several allegations on Dr. Vivek Bindra. Mm -hmm. But uh, I would say that uh, uh, there was some misselling. It was all the matter of uh, some misselling. And uh, Dr. Vivek Bindra also accepted his mistake. And mm. uh, Yes, uh, uh, this was the matter, and uh, the whole matter now is in Supreme Court. And uh, uh, yes, we should wait for the decision of Supreme Court. And uh, who is right? I, I would not tell you that who is right or wrong, uh, but it will be decided by Supreme Court of India. So mm -hmm. I think we should, have, we should have faith in Indian Constitution. We should have faith in Supreme Court, High Court. Uh, I would like to tell you one very serious thing. That is, in this country, this country is suffering from a new problem. Okay. And that is, the number of blind followers are increasing day by day. You mean people are blindly following? Uh, of course. Of course, absolutely. People are uh, following bl uh, blindly. Uh, mm. Blind follower may be related with Sandeep Maheswari. Blind followers are uh, uh, may be related with Dr. Vivek Bindra. Blind followers may be related with any uh, personality <laughs> or celebrities. Mm -hmm. mm. So uh, the problem is that uh, uh, when you analyze during dispute of Sandeep Maheswari and Dr. Vivek Bindra, Hmm. So there was masses, the uh, masses was being spreaded on social media, uh, on Instagram, Facebook, uh, that Sandeep Maheswari is Ram and Dr. Vivek Bindra is Ramad. Sandeep oh. Maheswari is hero and Dr. Uh -huh. Vivek Bindra is Vela. So, uh -huh. so, it, so it, it should not, it uh, use, uh, so this is the problem. So I, I have one here. I have one question here. You know, we talk about these motivational speakers. 
I wonder, are they really that charged and pumped up all the time? I mean, they don't have any problems in their life, or they are so cool about it. Actually, ma'am, uh, I will tell you very uh, uh, simple and logical uh, things. Mm. Is that you know Sandeep Maheswari is also a CEO and founder of Images Bazaar. Yeah, yeah, he was. Which is one, yes, Sandeep Maheswari is also CEO and founder of Images Bazaar, and Dr. Vivek Bindraj also CEO and founder of Bada Business Private Limited. So yeah. both have both people should understand this. Both are businessmen. Hmm. Both are earning money. Both are earning money. Uh, uh, so no one is God. Sandeep Maheswari is not a God, and Dr. Vivek Vidra is also not a God. So blind followers are uh, uh, where uh, uh, is spreading masses like uh, uh, Sandeep Maheswari is Ram and uh, uh, Dr. Vivek Vidra is Ram. So that is the biggest problem of uh, blind followers. So uh, I think hmm, I think I think India is suffering from with this new problem. Hmm. Hmm. Blind, yeah. followers, blind yeah. followers and WhatsApp University hmm. is very dangerous for this country. Uh, I would tell you. So yeah. I think there is a dark side of uh, social media, and hmm. uh, we should not follow blindly anybody. any personality i want to conclude with this conversation uh, one that uh, you know to learn english language once practice speaking and also i can say they can join some platforms uh, education institutes who offer english speaking sessions and that way they can really improve and second with this conversation sandeep meeshwari and vivek bindras uh, dispute we can say that nobody is god and we should not follow anyone blindly you of should course, think absolutely Hey, they are also human beings, and to err is human. There is a saying. So everybody makes mistakes, and nobody is. We can say dud ka dhola. <laughs> nobody is really pure, right? <laughs> okay. So thank you for this conversation, Deepa. Man, I'm sure this was uh, this would be really informative for all the learners here on my channel. Thank you and, very much, ma'am. I feel I feel uh, privileged to have session with you, and I was <laughs> very excited to talk with you. and uh, now now i am very happy to talk with you so thank you so much deepak and please take care of yourself bye thank you very much ma'am